I'm Stephanie from Renovation Baby and I want to show you how we made this gold and marbled shelf from a £12 galvanised shelf from B&Q. You can also get one um, in Ikea called the Ikea Hillis for £10 but b and is easier to get to at the moment. So here is this the shelf. I used a Rust-Oleum Bright Gold to spray up all the pieces. I laid them all out in this area and I managed to spray every single piece apart from the front on the top of the shelves make sure you put the screw heads in here and then you can spray them because these will be on show so that gives it a nice easy way of spraying them up i sprayed all the underside of them as well and then i turned the support bars over and i sprayed over the front over the sort of the front end that you'll see and then you must leave it for about 24 hours to dry and harden before you then can lay on your contact paper on the shelves now this contact paper is from amazon and it's got like a browny goldy marble effect to it and you lay it on top with your cutting board and your sort of paper knife and you can cut around the edges so that you have a single flat area that just goes on top of the shelf and leaves the sides for free um, I made sure I cut straight down so I had a nice flat edge to start with and line it up with and I used a little bit of contact paper on here to stop it from scratching off my gold lay on your contact paper it's like double sided sticky tape and you lay it on top on the front make sure you've got a nice clean front a nice clean edge and then you just need to pull it back and rub with a soft cloth then you're ready to pull everything together and just follow the instructions that come in the packaging and then you can build your shelf up you can either spray these little nuts down or not leave them exposed up to you but make sure you don't rub the metal against the metal because it scrapes and then pop the feet on here and then you're done and you've got your shelving unit already built ready for you to style up so you can hear the see the contact paper here so this is it was you know very relatively easy to put on but it gives you a nice surface that's wipeable and clean and it makes it like a marble effect that the gold and marble shells are very expensive whereas this is not and it's absolutely brilliant and I am so pleased with it so I want to give you a little um, show around about how I styled it with all the little bits and bobs on and they're all from companies that are local to you know easy to get to or I could do off order online for delivery so I got this little tea light actually from the Natural History Museum so it works perfect on here and these were uh, silver frames from Wilco and I spray painted those in rose gold and this little minimalist vase which I thought was quite sweet it was a couple of little pampas grass the pampas grass was on Amazon and I'm really quite pleased with it you blow a hairdryer on them to uh, make them fluff up which looks cute this plant hanging here is from Beard and Daisies and they've always done really lovely with their plants the black bowl is from Wilco and the gold plant pot is from my friend got me for my birthday but the fake plant from Wilco and this piece of newspaper in this box plant the box frame is actually um will be found in the walls when we were doing our house renovation from 1964 when it was built got a little sand jar from um ikea and some uh, recipe books another plant from beard and daisies and the pot is from home sense this little aladdin's a lamp was from uh, primark and the baskets were from amazon so they're great for putting the shoes that are coming from the garden in and things like that and they're kind of a bit of a plasticky kind of feeling to them so i'm really pleased with this it's absolutely yeah over the moon so thank you very much for watching click through to have a look at the blog post below and um, find out more